You ready? Mm-hmm. Are you recording? I'm on. All right, great. So we finished our workout, and so now we're going to have a post um, protein shake. Usually I like to put greens in it, but I haven't been to the grocery store, so it's just going to be hemp protein. And uh, because I don't do whey or anything like that because I'm trying not to um, do dairy and things like that, so I need products of that sort. But we will put hemp protein. I also have this vegan protein, mm. which is nice. Uh, it's a little sweeter, so I only put like a dab of it. It uses stevia, but I mainly use this product, um, Gero's Delicious. Organic. It says organic hemp. Ooh. And then I have um, organic chia seeds Ooh. that I add for fiber among other health benefits. And then I have organic almond milk because I pretty much use as much organic as possible. All right, so we'll keep it simple. We'll add some ice. Yo. that. Gonna add a scoop of the powder. We'll probably do two because we're serving three people, two people who don't want to be on camera for whatever uh, reason. Because we're half because whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm full. <laughs> two scoops. She's gonna have some protein. So it's good to have protein after you work out within two hours to help your body rebuild because you're breaking down the muscle fibers when you're exercising. So you need to get some branch aminos back into your system or some type of protein, okay? Can you have sugar? Is it not good? I mean, any processed sugar is not good for you. Um, if you're going to have something sweet, I would stick with fruit so okay. that it's natural sugars. Mm. But you, yeah, I mean, everyone knows we need to be easy on sugars, but... I like sugar. Yeah, who doesn't? <laughs> so then I put in like maybe two tablespoons of chia seed. Sure. And then finishing off the almond milk. So why is dairy not good? Well, um, we're the only, humans are like the only mammal who continues to drink milk after infancy. Hmm. And so it's in another animal's milk after infancy. Hmm. So it, it wreaks havoc on your digestive system. That's why a lot of people are lactose intolerant. And it also introduces other hormones into your body, which knocks your body off balance. It's just, you want to avoid it as much as possible. So I drink almond milk. You also want to be easy on soy. We'll get into all that. I'm just making a shake right all right. now. All right. All right. <laughs> so, so I do almond milk and I do organic coconut water. Ooh. Yes. Because it's very hydrating. Mm. Delicious. Yep, it's more hydrating than Gatorade. No offense, Gatorade. You taste good when we're out on a sports field, but coconut water is very good for you. All right, and then I have ice in there already, and then I just blend. Normally I would add a banana, or I would add some kale, or I'd add some sort of fibrous thing other than chia, but this is what we're gonna do right now. And that's not the right place. I think that's really oh it. my god it's okay this is the workout it's part of the workout <laughs> That's got ice still, but we'll That's ignore right. that. You can blend it longer. That's for the recommended. Ice. <laughs> for the ice to blend. I'm trying to make this video go quickly because I know people don't like sitting and watch it. Let me taste. Is it gross? No, no, it's actually good. Is it? Works. There we go. All right, enjoy. <laughs> Cheers.